Travelling back um, from Easter camping, did use some sun protection and slightly burnt shoulders, back, arms, and legs. Okay, first time in my life um, they did not burn. Yeah, look, it takes time. Eventually, you'll notice you'll get, you know, you won't get you won't get any burning. You'll get to the stage where I can stay out for for five hours, you know, and not get burnt. So it's basically nice and um, retinol and menaquinone 4, which are fat-soluble vitamins in the diet that are actually reducing. But also there's another thing. Um, the longer, the more years that pass, the more you have to, you turn over your cells, the more you get rid of stored damaged PUFA from your cells as you turn over the cells. And because you're on a, a low-carbohydrate diet, you've got higher... Um, uh, glutathione production, which means you recycle your vitamin D, sorry, your vitamin C and vitamin E, which basically then will electron dome and stabilize that tissue. And so you will end up with less reactive tissue because really it's, you know, these ox, these really bad um, fatty acids that are, that are oxidized and damaged, that have got less electrons, that incorporate in your tissue. UV radiation hits them, tends to create more inflammation, and then the liver will generate more matrix metalloproteinases. And that tends, if it's not regulated by fat soluble vitamins, tends to rather than heal, but aggravate the problem and um, psoriasis and all these sort of things. Anyway, depends on your genetics as well, how that will express that um, skin inflammation. But you will get more and more robust in being able to tolerate the sun.